Hello everyone, welcome to part 3 of the Ishkeon demo public build. And I did a little bit of building off camera, just for foundation work. And yeah, when I was talking with a friend, I asked them what they think I should build here, and one of their suggestions was a museum of my previous Minecraft worlds. That's what I believe they said, or something. Yeah, I don't know the exact words, but one of the ideas I came up with was a museum of my previous Minecraft worlds that I've had that don't exist anymore. So yeah, that's basically it for just explaining what this is. Oh, and there's also cool new things I want to show. Stairs up to the museum. We go down this tunnel. We still go down. Yeah, we're going down even more. Then we go down this. And now we're in the bank. Yep, we're now here. We're now in the bank. We can do all these cool things. Now, I'm going to do a time lapse. Okay, I'm almost there. We're back after nearly four hours of time lapsing, and the thing I built, you guys should actually see it. 
but I'm gonna have to fly up really high for how big of a scale this is. But prepare yourselves. This is what I built in that almost four hours. So, some of you might be thinking that it's a hollow empty cube. Well, this cube right here is, first off, enormous. Just look how big this cube is compared to me. Hello. And, in fact, it is actually taller than the bank, which... This thing I thought was just crazy tall, because it has one, two, three, four, five, six floors, and all those floors are five blocks high. This is, oh, this is taller than that even. And there's stuff in there which I will in fact show another time, but, but yeah, this it's kind of like that one like arch thing. That you would see in like Paris, France or something. And that's what this is supposed to be like. It's supposed to be like that one arch thing in Paris, France. I don't know its name, but all I know is that it's a giant arch. But yeah, I'm going to be building something here. It's gonna be something a little strange, but hopefully you guys actually like it. Okay, I have to figure it out. Hmm. Okay, I believe I have figured it out. Let's see, we have... No, we're actually going to build something on there in another video, but... I'm actually going to build something up here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Let's see, we have five, no, I'd say about six, maybe seven. Now, if you see what my character looks like, you'll know what we're building is that banner right there. And I'm also going to show you how to make the banner. Okay, we have that. <laughs> but yeah, that's what we have right here. Mm -hmm. We have that. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh wait, I forgot. The red part is over top of it. Then we have this. Might be building it wrong, but let's see. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
Each part should have at least nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh, that's not good. Yeah, I probably didn't make it the proper number, but at this point, it's still turning out pretty good. Let's see, we need orange. Oh, do not want to fall from that height if we were in survival. And especially if this was a hardcore world. Because if it was a hardcore world, then, well, I'd have to kiss this whole place goodbye. And this place is pretty cool. Let's see what we have. Yeah, after this, I'm actually going to show you how to make the banner, and then I'm just going to be done for today. Because I I don't think it's even... I think it's been more than four hours. For all we... Oh, that's an issue, but don't worry. It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. Okay, let's see what we need. And it's actually a little disappointing, but yeah, that took about like five or six minutes to build. That is how big it is compared to this. But yeah, that's going to be like a flag thing up there. And it's not a pride flag, it's actually some it's actually a nation flag for a fictional nation I came up with. Yeah, in a couple months this whole like fictional town and fictional nation stuff will be a lot more clear. Okay, I don't want cobbled deep slate. Okay, I want a loom. Got it? Okay, let's see, we need our dyes, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple, or magenta, depending on what mood you're in. Okay, we have that. Now I actually gotta go inside to make this. I actually have to- wait, this house better not have a loom inside of it. Oh, that's actually a little sad, it doesn't. Well, let's see, and... Okay. Okay, for our design, we s Okay, let's see. Believe it or not, we don't actually start off with red. We actually start off with a a yellow. Sh no, that doesn't seem right. <sighs> yeah, we have a yellow stripe down the middle. Let's see this now. We take. Oh, I messed it up. We were supposed to put the different colors orange for top gradient. Blue for. Let's see. Bottom gradient. Then we get our yellow dye for our... 
Wait, what what middle line do I want to use? I'll use this. We get our purple dye. Make our line right there. We get our red dye. Make our banner. And then let's see what we get. Okay, and now the banner is complete, and now let's place it up somewhere. There it is. That is what the banner looks like. Yeah, it's one of many banners that will go up there. Okay, let's... You know what, let's put it r them right here. And, well, that's basically all, so... Bye.